Hey guys, so today is the 20th book review Friday that I've done, and I'm really excited because I have enjoyed doing these book reviews, I have enjoyed sharing the books that I enjoy reading with those of you that watch. Today's video is late because this morning I woke up early and I have plans for Saturday, and I had to do everything that I normally do on Saturday today and it was just crazy, it was hectic, and I fell asleep, and then I woke up and was just kind of panicking, going, I forgot a book, or to do a video, a book review today. So, it, it wouldn't be the same if it wasn't posted on Friday. So, anyways, I'm going to get this posted, or get it filmed in the app. So, today's book is The Counterfeit Convert by Lisa Chadwick, and this is one that I just grabbed off the shelf in our little thing. It's like a library on wheels. Anyways, and I ended up enjoying it. And I did read the last chapter, so I was like, oh, that was really more of like the last page here, I guess you can say. And I was like, oh, that's a good story. This would be a good one. And then I read, because I read the back, the end first, and then I read the front, and I was like, as I started reading, I was like, wait, what, now, now what? But, it's about three guys who live in, I guess, a, like, what you call, like, poor, well, oh, itchy, um, anyways, they're, they're down on their luck, guys, and as they're going out to celebrate, I think it was a friend, it's been a while since I've read it, but it's, I think it was a friend's job, and they end up meeting these three rich sisters, and they find out that before the oldest sister can inherit the money, she has to be married. So, one of them poses as a, a convert or a member of the LDS church in order to get him to like her. Anyways, she finds out, and I'm just going to leave it at that. So... Anyways, guys, this is a short one today. Um, I'm going to go back to bed and get up early tomorrow. But thanks, guys, for watching these and letting me, I guess, express myself to you guys. Letting me, I guess, share my interests with you guys. Let me know in the comments below what kind of books you like reading. Where some of your favorite authors are or series and if you like I've said this in another video if you like to read with a Kindle or paper books my preference is paper books because I even though you can mark on a Kindle or an e-reader or electronically I can write and you can do notes there but I can do, write notes here and I can have this and my device can crash and be, stuff will be gone I've had that happen before, even though I've saved it. Anyways, thanks guys for watching, and I will see you in tomorrow's video. Bye guys!